top 10 historical dramas have received overwhelmingly positive reviews, setting the standard for the genre. Recently, although historical dramas like The Rise of Nian, Kill Me, Love Me, Snow at Night, Timeless Love, and Love of Nirvana have been coming out one after another, the reviews have been mixed. The Rise of Nick has been one of the better received Chinese dramas lately, with an interesting plot, but some viewers think that the domestic rivalry storyline is dumbed down and the adaptation strays too far from the original novel, falling short of truly high-rated masterpieces. Over the past five years, there have been a few historical dramas that have received overwhelmingly positive feedback from audiences. Here are 10 top-rated ceiling dramas in the genre. Jeff Light, Love Like the Galaxy and Love Between Fair and Devil have both great reputations and popularity, with the last one having zero negative reviews. Number 1. Love and Redemption has an open rating of 7.5. Love and Redemption is adapted from the novel Liu Li Meiren Shaw by Xu Chiang Lan. The original book is said to be a mix of eternal love and ashes of love, which has made it super popular among fans. So Love and Redemption was highly anticipated even before it aired and it didn't disappoint when it was released. Fans of the original book are really happy with the adaptation of Love and Redemption. The male lead Cheng Yi brings the feelings from the novel to life, while the female lead Juan Bing Yan delivers a fantastic performance. The chemistry is off the charts. The story lies well organized, the pacing is smooth and is packed with sweet moments, while also delivering some serious drama. It's a definitely standout. Number 2. Love Like the Galaxy had Doban rating 7.7. .7. Love Like the Galaxy is a highly rated Chinese drama from 2022 that tells the story of a young general, Ling Bu Yi, who carries a heavy burden from his past, and Chong Shao Shang, a stay at home girl whose parents are often away fighting. Through countless trials, they heal each other and work together to resolve a national crisis. Unlike previous historical romance dramas, Love Like the Galaxy features an impressive ensemble cast, which is catered from the Cheng and Ling families to the royal family having their own distinct traits. Live Like the Galaxy features solid and meaningful script that doesn't just randomly throw in a sweet roman without logic. The love story between Cheng Shaoshang and Ling Puyi is developed gradually, making it feel authentic. With Wen Lei and Chao Lucia as the leads, the casting is spot on and the director of filming style adds a touch of sophistication. All these elements come together to create this well-received historical romance drama. Number 3. Joy of Life has a double rating of 7.9 and 7.3. The first season of Joy of Life was a phenomenal hit, breaking over 10 billion views online and getting a high score of 7.9 on Doban. While her second season is still going strong, the second season is the highest viewed Chinese drama of 2024, surpassing 4.4 billion views, beating out shows like Blossom Shanghai, The Legend of Shen Li and The Tao of Rose. The second season also has a Doban rating of 7.3. Although it didn't surpass the first season, the play is so still solid, and both seasons are definitely worth watching. Jeff Fly has a unique tone that sets it apart from the usual heavy political dramas. This show is sometimes humorous and lighthearted, while the other time it delves into gritty realism. The characters are deep and complex, each with their own schemes and hidden agendas, and the twists should keep coming. Number 4. Love in Between has a Doban rating of 7.9. Love in Between is a highly rated drama from the first half of 2020, adapted from the novel of the same name by Ji Wei Liu Nian. It's a real shame that it didn't get much promotion, so not many people know about it. However, those who have seen it have given it a high praise with a Doban rating of 7.9. Love in Between doesn't have any big name stars, but the new actors really carry the show. While the story differs a lot from the original novel, the overall plot is even more exciting. The narrative flows well with a perfect pace, and the characters are vibrant. The action scenes are thrilling, and the costume, makeup, and setting are all beautifully crafted. It's truly a quality drama. Number 5. Love Between Fairy and Devil has a Doban rating of 8.2. Love Between Fairy and Devil is the highest rated Chinese drama from the summer 2022 season. And after rubbing up, it saw to a Doban rating of 8.2, outperforming its contemporaries Love Like the Galaxy and Immortal Samsara. 
Interestingly, when it first premiered, online viewers were skeptical, especially since Wang Hedi, known for his role in Mr. Dragon, had left an impression as a poorly acted and attractive character. But as it went on, everyone ended up loving it. The plot and character setups in Love Between Fairy and Devil might feel a bit cliche, but the emotional development is really nuanced. The growth art of Dong Fang Xingqiang is well crafted. He starts off as a cold, heartless figure, but gradually learns to love things to the influence of Xiao Lan Kua. The powerful Demon King character is also a fresh take, and the chemistry between Yu Shu Xin and Wang Ke is off the charts. It's both cheesy and sweet, totally addictive. Number 6. The Blood of Youth had a Doban rating of 8.3. The Blood of Youth is definitely a must-watch martial arts drama in recent years. It initially flew under the radar, but once viewers started watching, they praised the plot for being surprisingly engaging. The story follows the young hero Lei Weiqi, who, while on his way to the renowned Snow Moon City, accidentally stumbles into the Snowfall Villa and gets caught up in a series of events in the martial arts world. The performances in the Blood of Youth are all on point, while the fight scenes and special effects getting a lot of praise. The director really captured the essence of youth in the martial arts world. This summer, the sequel Dashing Youth also premiered, and both the romantic are based on stories from the same author, so they connected. However, Dashing Youth hasn't received the same high rating as the Blood of Youth, showing that there's a difference in the director's skills. Number 7. Word of Honor has a Doban rating of 8.5. Word of Honor is a dark horse hit drama from 2021. After its finale, it maintained a high Doman rating of 8.5, making it the highest rated historical drama of 2021. The show is adapted from Priest's popular novel, Tian Ya Kuo, and it has received high praise from fans of the original work, which is quite rare since original fans are usually the hardest to please, but Word of Honor managed to do it. Word of Honor was original one of the least anticipated dramas among the many adaptations in 2021 because of the two male lists weren't very famous. However, once it's aired, Word of Honor is actually great, quickly started training on Weibo. The pacing of the plot is good and the story adaptation is reasonable which really surprised viewers. Number 8. Mysterious Lotus Skatebook has a Doban rating of 8.5. Mysterious Lotus Skybook has received great reviews and performed well online. It premiered in the summer of 2023, facing off again Chang Yi Lost You Forever and Xiao Chan's Along With Promise. Initially, Mysterious Lotus Skybook wasn't particularly expected to do well, but after it aired, it made a comeback thanks to its solid script. Moreover, Mysterious Lotus Skybook has strong staying power. Even after the show ended, many fans found themselves unable to move on, binge-watching it multiple times. Mysterious Lotus Skybook combines a word share with mysterious solving. Chung Yi plays Li Xiang Yi, who is just 20 years old, aims to become the leader of the martial arts world, gaining fame but also making a lot of enemies. After suffering serious injuries and falling into the sea, he decides to leave his past behind and live under the name Li Lianhua. After meeting Fang Tiaoping, the two team up to solve various murder cases in the martial arts realm. Number 9. Strange Tales of Tang Dynasty series has a Dowan rating of 8 and 8.6. Strange Tales of Tang Dynasty series is a historical detective drama that has received zero negative reviews in recent years. It didn't have any big name stars or a massive budget, but it had gains falling thanks to its great reputation among fans. The first season scored an 8, while the second season climbed to an 8.6, which is impressive since it's rare for a second season of a Chinese drama to outshine the first. Strange Tales of Tang Dynasty had a great sense of mystery, Thai logical reasoning, and perfectly captured the charm of Tang Dynasty. It also brilliantly portrays the power struggles among various factions. It's truly a gem. With the success of the first two seasons, the third season Strange Tales of Tang Dynasty 3 to Chang Yang has been confirmed for production. It tells the story of Lu Ling Fei, an skilled martial artist, and Xu Wu Ming, the disciple of Church Li, as they go from being rivals to mutual respect and team up to solve complex cases.